this is gonna be a pretty awesome project right here. If y'all would subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out, I'm probably gonna do this one in a couple different phases. Hit like and share if you would, I appreciate that. Here's a drone footage of the project we're getting started on. We're gonna be removing the circular decks, the stair systems, the uh, vinyl retainer walls. We're gonna install a new vinyl seawall down right behind the rectangular deck leave that up about eight foot. Then we're gonna level the yard off and go back to a wooden retainer wall just off the uh, edge of the pool to kind of level the yard up, give them a flat surface. Some of the problems that you deal with on this project is what do you do with all the dirt? We've got a lot of dirt that we've got to move back and forth. So we got to make areas where we can store the dirt while we are installing the wall. several sets of stairs underneath this uh, staircase we had here. It looks like they added on and added on again. So we're going to go ahead and remove that and after looking at the lower wall, talk to the customer, I don't think that I would build an upper wall on this wall trusting to support my wall. So we're going to go ahead and excavate that whole hillside right there, remove that wall, and install a new uh, Everlast Vinyl Sea Wall in front of it with some 8 inch 25 foot pilings also. This whole deck here is going to be coming out, the wall behind it. We've already started removing this as you can see. Our upper upland wall will be going in the upper area up there and then we'll remove this wall on this side as well as this deck here this curved deck and install a new wall below it eight foot exposed definitely a lot of work to do on this project here after excavating behind the uh, vinyl seawall you can see that the Tyvek system was only four to five foot behind the wall, which is not adequate. Also, you can see that the corner of this wall is blown out, separating. The wall is starting to move towards the bay, just not tied back properly. Day two progress. Got a bunch of the wall tore out. Whole lot of trash to clean up now. Taking this ramp apart and you can see the walls leaning over pretty bad was kind of figuring it had a bad deadman system or tieback system when we got to it. Pulled two foot behind the seawall. As you can see, definitely did not work. See this whole thing bowed out. Here's another drone shot of the project. We've been on this for four days doing straight demo. I think we hauled off five to six trailer loads of 25 foot trailers so far. We got our elevations cut in the hillside, got some poles set on each corner. Now we're ready to start setting. Hey, thanks for watching this project here as we get started. Please subscribe, hit the notification bell up top so you don't miss the next segment of this project. Like and share.